I think I need to go rig a line in that fig tree. Climbing trees in the rainforest is something I've been doing for years for research and for photography. Uh, I get a rope up in the tree using a bow and arrow, shoot a fishing line over a branch, and then uh, use that to pull up a big climbing rope. Tim's aiming for something new, an image he's never been able to capture in 25 years of wildlife photography. One shot that I really want to get is to show the orangutan in the context of its habitat, up in the canopy at the orangutan's level. That's much harder than it sounds. Orangutans are too smart to approach a tree with a human in it, so Tim plans to use remote cameras instead. It seems like if you set those camera traps, you should set it on the other side. She's going to climb up that fig root, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. She went up right up. You know, orangutans are the largest canopy living animal in the world, so if you don't get up here in the trees to get a sense of what things are like from their perspective, you can't really tell the story of the lives of orangutans. Tim's betting that Walima and Ned will come back for more figs tomorrow without noticing the cameras. Last time I tried camera traps in the canopy, orangutans were just a little too smart. They noticed the camera, they were a little wary. That's why I went up this time after the orangutans are well away from here. And I'm using some really small little cameras. So, see if I can fool them. All right, coming down. The remote cameras are in place. And Tim is ready to record amazing new images if the orangutans return. <laughs>